I've been, I've been working out, crossing about five or six days a week the past year and a half. Uh, it's, it's the constantly varied workouts, so nothing's the same. Um, each workout, the feeling is, is different. As far as um, we, you have a, a pain tolerance that changes, you have uh, the cardio aspect that changes. So if you get a workout where there's a lot of gymnastics and some heavier strength movements, I'll excel in those. It's a little bit more geared towards me. Um, those longer duration workouts are, are what I've been really working on the past six months. Um, building my engine, building my cardio um, to, to really compete at a high level because the higher level athletes, they're not a master at once, one thing, so they're, they're good at everything. And that's where, that's where I'm really focused on getting better at. I pretty much know now, um, going at every workout, that it's going to come. It's, it's adjusting when it hits you because you don't know whether it's going to be muscle fatigue or cardio fatigue or just mental fatigue in the workout um, until you really start it. Um, but once it comes, it kind of settles me down um, and gets me, gets my mind um, back where it needs to be. Um, it's, I kind of embrace it and the sooner it hits me, the better in a way because then I, I can kind of taper off or push um, when I need to. I'll, I'll know that in advance after the first couple of movements where I'm going to be throughout the workout. And another, another thing that's it's real important um, in, in, the, in the workouts and the Metcons is to, to be patient. You have to be very patient and, and understand your body on when to take it back because as you were saying before, when we redline, um, and if it's a timed workout, um, you know, the, the goal is to be keep our intensity levels as high as possible. So if we're redlining too early or we redline too late, um, that can make the difference on, on winning or losing or wherever you, your goal is to place um, or finish. So um, just gotta be patient with the workout, be patient with your body um, and kind of adjust, adjust incrementally um, as the workout progresses. So today we'll do a, um, a standard CrossFit um, style program workout, it's called a chipper. We're going to start at a, a higher value, so we're going to start at 50, 50 reps and then we work our way down until we get to the 10 reps, so 50, 40, 30, 20, 10. Um, what we'll do today is 50 double unders and the goal is to get the 50 double unders unbroken, don't want to start over. The 40 we'll do our wall balls, so it's a squat into the the toss on the 10 foot target with a 20 pound medicine ball. The 30, we're gonna do chest to bar pull ups. 20, we will do handstand push ups, and then we will finish it off with uh, clean and jerks, power clean and jerks at uh, 225. 